When doing your holiday shopping this year, you may automatically reach for the plastic, but did you know there are some hidden perks that can come along with it? Here to let us in on the secrets is Market Watch reporter Katie Hill. Katie, great to see you. you. So there are some credit card benefits that if you don't use them amount to essentially leaving cash on the table. Is that right? That's exactly right. Tons of them, actually. Many credit cards carry big benefits that people have no idea that even exist, and they don't use them. I love that. There's one that can amount to something like $2,400 worth of, what, return? 2500 So these credit card companies, um, a little, I think it's about one in four credit cards offer something called guaranteed returns. So let's say you buy a sweater at a store and, and it has a 30-day return policy, which is pretty standard. Day 31 or day 60, you're like, you know what? That thing is still sitting in my closet. You know, it has its tags on. I'm never going to wear it. What do I do? Often your credit card will refund you. Even if price. the store won't? Even if the store won't. But then do you have to return the merchandise to the credit card company? You return it to your credit okay. card company. Now, what they do with it, I don't know, but I'm hoping there's a big <laughs> warehouse somewhere that we can all shop one right. day. <laughs> and there's no limit to uh, the amount of things you can return? Or? There, there's a limit. Usually it's a per item limit, okay. somewhere between 250 and 500 per item. And per year, it's usually somewhere between 1000 and 2500 But again, that could be $2,500 if you're one of those people, especially during the holidays, who buys something, sits in your closet with the tags on, we've all done it, yes. and then you can return it maybe. Oh, I think, yeah, absolutely. I'm definitely guilty of that. Now, what about price protections? Many cards offer this, right? Yes. So you'll say you buy something, and then you see it, the price dropped later, and you're like, oh, I just paid too much for it, the price dropped, your credit card might refund you the difference. About half of cards offer that. Now, it's not that easy to get, right? You have to send your credit card company the receipt, you have to show them the new price, but hey, it's worth it. If you, you know, if it's 50 bucks, 100 bucks, like that's worth your time Absolutely. to do. Absolutely. Now, finally, I want to talk about these cashback cards, because we hear a lot about them, but they're not all created equal. So yes. you did a little digging yes. and came up with a, your top three list, right? Yes. So let's start with the blue cash preferred from American Express, 6% on groceries, 3% on gas, and right now they have a 10% cash back on 6 Amazon. 6% back on groceries? Up to 6000 a year. So that's wow. that's pretty good. That I mean, that's often good. most people's big chunk of their spending. So I really like that one. And there's not too many categories there. You know, when you're like, I can't remember that yes. category, it's those rotating categories. This is a pretty simple one. I love that. And then what about City Double Cash? That's City Double Cash is 1% cash back on everything. And then when you pay your bill, even if it's just the minimum, another 1% back. Simple, no categories, 1% on unlimited, and then 1% when you pay your bill. On everything. Yeah, everything you buy. That's what I like Just about put it. Your you mortgage, have, put your yes. mortgage You're on like, your credit card. You go. Yeah, <laughs> I love that. Over. And what yes. about Chase Freedom Unlimited? This is just a flat 1.5% cash back. I like everything. these because the rotating categories, people forget what it is. They're like, is it gas this month? Is it yeah. you know, department stores this month? And people forget and they miss out on it. These are just simple, straight cards. But are these cards with fees? We, I mean, if you don't pay your bill, you're going to pay a high right, interest on right. these fees. Uh, but, I mean, do they have yearly fees? Some of these cards have fear. Fees. I think these are no annual fee, but you have to you have to go and check those because you never know. Sometimes These these terms always change right. on credit cards. So you got to, when you sign up, you got to look for them. Always I'm pretty sure the these fine are all print, But I might need to sign up for one of these I before know, I do my I holiday know, shopping. Got to get some cash back. <laughs> I know it, I know <laughs> Katie, thank you so <laughs> thank much you. for that.